Bubble this grand mountain! <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
long bound by worldly pain, now free in nature's Have you seen those nameless souls adrift on your path? Their wills float aloft, never to fade. Shame, your god serves little purpose, and mine answers solely to me. Hmm. I know a way to guide the souls, mend their paths, and set them free. It will aid you. This is better. This gourd, though humble, may save the lost, banish their obsessions, and guide them. For one as destined as you, there can be no turning back. We are like tumbleweeds, drifting through life, with a destiny beyond our grasp.
This humble one's name is Guangmo. Should my demise come by your hands, please pass this message to my master. Searching for deity, mortals do aspire. Craving immortality, Yao Guai's surely will conspire! Elder Jincha to burn the great sage and tongue monk alive. That's a great. I thought they were already turned into ashes by that fire. Who would have thought they had turned into Yao Guais?
<laughs> These snake guys are nothing to fear. Snake gall steeped in drink, though, makes a fine tonic to flush malady. Here, here, young friend. Be my guest inside. I'd stake your one more monkey from Mount Huaguo. Uh, I've met many of you. <laughs> By rank of birth, you all ought to call me fo- I brought treasure from- Right as you will, joy is what counts. Next time, down a few mouthfuls in one go! It's delightful! <laughs> Hailed bird, hailed bird, what dimmed your shine? Past's grip beyond our grasp, the future we may still clasp. Late is the hour, young one, in which you choose to stay in my tranquil abode. Pray tell. To what end do you seek? <laughs> Gentle, yet it engulfs all the power of water. Can you feel it? No! 
Now you shall face what I truly am! Ripple away, not with a Summon. Yeah. <laughs> 
No ill will, I bear. I'm merely my brother's eyes and ears. I feign my loyalty to guard this path on the bear's order. Your destiny's bleak and stark. In its grip, we share the mark. The Guanyin Temple now lies in cinders. Yet the Elder Soul endures. The root of greed ever fosters the stem of suffering. <sighs> Better to forget the thing you truly seek. The three bells. Have you seen them all? Do you too desire that which they ceaselessly hold dear? The bells. Three bells were set in the mountains since the Black Wind Guire's return, yet no one is allowed to go near them. Maybe the bells have something to do with the temple's burning. His words sound like truth to me, little monkey. Stay sharp and keep a lookout.
must know of this. Five hundred years. I have rebuilt the temple. Now it's grander in scope. All those monks consumed by the fire turn to wandering ghosts roaming in Black Wind Mountain. It was I who granted them eternal repose. I have even restored the charred scriptures, piece by piece. <laughs> but oh yes, I always knew. One day you shall return! <laughs>
Next time, down a few mouthfuls in one go! You challenge me without even letting me have dinner first! Oh. Some cheap tricks. Meet me at the summit if you dare! <laughs> the spell he 
just cast may appear intricate, but it's not hard to learn. That Black Bear's expertise is lacking. Serving Guan Yin didn't help him much. But what he left here could surely help us. Consider today your lucky day. <laughs> Focus and disperse, illusions traverse. You still have a lot to learn. Give yourself a time 